a man who's been on the country Irish scene for 35 years, with 10 albums to his credit, and indeed one award-winning DVD. Would you welcome, please, Pat Jordan. <laughs> well, welcome, Pat. Thank you very much, Richard. You're very welcome to A Little Bit of Ireland, our brand new TV show. Um, had you heard about it? Or you heard the new show? Well, I've heard all about the new show, and of course, when I got the call to come and appear, Grant. that was great. great. Thank you very delighted. much for having me in. I'm delighted. You're no stranger to television, of course. You've been on uh, Cold Feet, and uh, right. of course, you've been with Julie Walters, Paul Risling, and Ricky Tomlinson. That's right. With, uh, in the my Beautiful Son. Beautiful uh, film about, yeah, My Beautiful Son. Yeah. Great, great film. So, what's it like to be a TV star? Oh, God. Uh, with a very small part. Don't blink now, you might miss it if you do watch it. Well, I saw it actually, and uh, you were on for a bit there. We were. There was one point where we were on, on stage you were, you with were Julie saying, Walters stood yeah, by my, my yeah. side and uh, yeah. uh, welcomed her son, Bessie, home from America. And yeah. It was good, yeah, it was good crack. You're a busy man. Busy, Richard. It, yeah, took, us a long God, time, yeah. it took us a long time to get hold of you. Gosh. And when we did, uh, I mean, obviously, you're very busy. Tell me uh, the great guns of the band. Very busy. Band is going great. Uh, very busy as usual. Busy, doing a lot of festivals and of course uh, yeah. doing a lot of trips abroad with your sponsors. Of course, enjoy travel. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Oh, we we can't forget them. Oh. Your uh, of course um, new album recently. New album out. It's going very well. Yeah. Tell us tell us a bit about the new album. Um, it's a fourteen is... fourteen track uh, yeah. album. Yeah. yeah. Called uh, the title track is uh, "Turn the Wine Back Into Water." Yeah. Um, it's going very well. Um, couple of new tracks on it uh, that have been written for me and the uh, rest are just uh, covers basically. But it seems to be, it seems to be selling well. This is one of, of ten albums now well, to date. Some, some like, and I've forgotten being honest with you. Yeah. Uh, but also all very successful in their own right. Now, I liked particularly well. Farewell My Lovely, beautiful album. Yes, great. And then great the album, one, yeah. uh, You Can't Turn Back the Years, That's of course, right, was yes. another successful yeah, album yeah. for you as well. Um, those two particular albums I did like because I thought they were fantastic and they, they seem to be, you seem to be getting better. Well, that's a bit nice like cheese say. maybe, um, <laughs> mature with cheese. Uh, see, the voice seems to be getting better and better and better. So what do you contribute that to? I honestly don't know. People have told me that as, as, as I'm getting older. I thought it'd be the opposite, that the, yeah. the voices start going downhill a bit. But yeah. uh, I noticed the same thing with Brendan Shine. The older he gets, the better he gets. I noticed why I've had to change some of my keys. Actually, I'm, I'm seem to be singing higher these days, right. uh, as well. I'm, I'm, I'm sort of a little bit more power into into the into the voice. Okay. Tell uh, me some of the places you're now uh, getting to. Well, we're off to Ibiza in a couple of weeks' time. With uh, as enjoy I said, travel. enjoy travel. Yeah. Um, and um, we're we're um, then we're with them again in uh, October in Portugal. Uh, a couple of weeks in Portugal, and, and then uh, we've got a cruise down the Nile. Yeah. In November. I noticed now, uh, over the last six to seven years, you're doing an awful lot out of the country. So, um, does that uh, cause you problems uh, in terms of getting, for the, for the bookings in the UK, people can't get a hold of you? Or? Well, no, we're still busy in the UK. We're, we're, we're become, we've really become a festival band. We've been, of course, with James McKeefe Festival yeah. and, and, of course, with, with New World Breaks yes, as course, well. Yeah. We've done a gig with them last week. And, uh, right. So uh, we, we, we've done a lot of festivals and, and still done, of course, done the, the clubs. Yeah. Uh, and of course, we do a lot of country clubs as well. Yeah. OK. And yes, I noticed that you're very versatile in terms of the country scene. Well, we had to we had to diversify when when in the, when that lull sort of in a couple uh, ten years ago, when things started changing around a little bit, we decided we'd, we'd have to change the band to, to suit. Mm. Uh, probably try and suit all ages basically. So we, we sing a, a broad spectrum of music like... Now the business is very tough at the moment of course and I notice you the same with uh, many other bands have reduced the band slightly but uh, nonetheless the sound is still brilliant. The sound is still good, yeah. The boys are, the boys are great. The boys have been great with me. The boys have been now, very Kieran, with me. your musical director, Kieran Tarry, Kieran he's Tarry, been Mike, with you yeah. for how many uh, years? Kieran's been with me now 20 years gone. And Steve yeah. Flynn of course, so the Steve, guitarist. Was, Steve joined me when he was 17 and Fantastic. Steve, great Steve, musicians. Great, great, great musicians. musicians. I know that they've backed me a few times at various venues and uh, I say it's a credit to them that I can actually get up without any rehearsals and do it. Uh, oh, they're very good at Buskin, Richard, yeah, yeah. excellent. Very, days, very good you know, band. Yeah. Yeah. You've been very lucky because you tend to keep your band. I've been, that's what I'm saying, the boys have been very loyal. They've had mm. loads of offers, yeah. but they've been very, very loyal to me. Right. And what do you put that down to? Because it certainly isn't money, is well, it? Well, it's not money. With you. But I, well, I look after <laughs> I, I look after them. No, I look after them. I do. I do yeah. look after them, you know. Right, I okay. think, and, and the feeling, feeling is mutual. They look after me and I look after them. You've yeah. got to do. Yeah. But yeah. they're good boys as well. They're, yeah. you, they get on yeah. very well with, very, of course, all, good, your, yeah. all yeah. your... And the fan club is doing very well. 
fan club is doing great. My daughter Amanda is running a fan club. Yeah. That's going very well, yeah. 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 And so do you, do you find the work now is split between the two, half in the UK now and half abroad? Uh, we're doing a, yeah, we're doing quite a bit of work abroad, yeah. Uh, uh, we, we've, uh, I suppose, uh, we do, well, it's maybe 75% of work in the UK. Of course, we, we play Ireland as well. We're off the How Ireland long have you, you been with Jerry Flynn now? How long? Because uh, Well, Jerry and I go back a long way because yeah. Jerry and I actually worked in, uh, in a band together. Go away. In Manchester's top night spot. Right. Uh, in fact, Jerry interviewed me for my first job as a singer after I'd left the band called The Ranchers. Okay. And uh, Jerry was the drummer with the Carousel Band. Most fabulous band uh, going. They were uh, the best resident band probably in the UK. And, and it was then at Manchester's top night spot, the Carousel. And Jerry was inter interviewed for, the, for me for the job. And uh, I remember I got there in the night, Richard, and there was, there was guys there playing guitars and keyboard. And I thought, oh, I might as well go home now. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I'd done, me, I'd done me three songs. And... Uh, I was told to go and wait at the restaurant for a cup, have a cup of coffee. And uh, Jerry came in, he called me out, and I thought, this is me going home. He says, uh, what are you doing for the rest of the night? And I said, uh, well, nothing planned. Well, he said, right, you've got the job. Will you join us on stage for the second half? And it was great, and that's where... Mm, and ever since. And we got, well, Jerry and I got back a long way. Well, listen, Pat, uh, thanks very much indeed for coming in. We do appreciate you coming all this way. We know you're a busy man, and uh, we did eventually get hold of you. But listen, I wish you all the best for the future. Good luck now with all the uh, the new albums. Of course, the brand new DVD is available. Just give us the website so that people can get a hold of the information for the DVD and all that sort uh, of thing. The DVD is, is on, on, on our gig sales. It's also uh, through uh, irishmusic.co.uk. Okay and at various other outlets as well. Okay, well listen Pat, the best of luck to you and thanks very much indeed it's for coming It's a pleasure, thank you very much for having me. Thank you.